Where we at right now, big homie? I mean, shit. We, we in Sal's Palace right now at DTP. This is Taj TV? Yeah, man. We doing our thing, it's the man. the fade to black, man. Huh? It's the fade, fade to black. black. All right. This is what we doing, man. Um, fade to black. Taj version. It's For sure, man. Chunky ass office. You can see folders with contracts and I never look in any of those. It's definitely not for me. So, <laughs> chilling, bro. Uh, Taj in the A. That's my man Bash right there. Get him on there. Yeah, you probably see him a lot. Luda, you know, like you know, probably Luda, know him. Luda like my way, dude. <laughs> you know what else you Nah, this the real. Let me get a story. This the original homie. <laughs> Sent me an email. How long ago? I was like last three year. Years ago, dog. That one was three years ago. Like three years like ago. Like two years ago. <laughs> this ugly face in it, right? So I pulled this shit up. Hey, who is this nigga? That face was terrible, wasn't it? Uh, beard, all that shit. Well, I played the beat. Yeah, I'm, it was that monster joint, right? Yeah. The beat was a monster. I'm like, ooh, he got some heat. So I took it to my man Ken. His office is over there. He don't even be here no more. Ken Bailey. That's his old office. I played it for him. He was like, yo, that shit's hard. You should get it to Luda. Then uh, he played for Shaka. Shaka was like, yo, that's the joint. So I sent it to Luda. And Luda never responded. God, that's <laughs> but crazy. But what happened is, the story is, he sent me, he built a relationship, so he started sending me more beats. And he had another joint. I don't even know what the name of it was. And it was just a joint he sent me. And I sent it to Chris. And Chris was like, it hit me back the next day. Like, yo, I love it. Hold on to it, so. That was about two years ago, so we're still waiting for it to pop up on an album somewhere. He still sends me beats. I still send him out, but basically that started the, the relationship with him musically where he always brings me music. Eventually, you know, we went to a couple parties and stuff. He was cuffing shit. That's a whole nother story. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, don't say nothing, man. It's my turn. national national red bone or something. Yo, man. national yeah, red bone. Out, bro. <laughs> nah, we went to like a, uh, yeah. it was like a hipster party in like a basement, but it was popping. But um, from there, he eventually told me he had an artist named Taj. I hear that all the time. You know what I'm saying? But since it's my homie, I know he got good music. I was like, all right, check it out. And um, I was on tour with, with uh, the Ludacris tour and listened to the CD, and the shit was, like, quality. It was thorough. It was like, the dude is, what, 16, 17, whatever. He produces. He writes his own joints. And I was impressed, so it was a good thing. Like, you don't find too many young cats making music, quality music. I grew up on hip hop not did I, I listen to everything but it was quality music from the production to the lyrics so that made me stand out and, and, and check it out and um now he in the a right now i'm gonna play me some more music like you know first time i met him actually holla at him on what facebook chopped it up a little something and um he got beats too though so he's gonna play some beats he's gonna play some songs show. listen to it they showed up late for this meeting we were trying to get it in this week <laughs> Went sat with TK and Cash the other day, gave them some tracks. They gonna fuck with a couple of those, and uh, we just building, man. So it's, you know, it's nothing, man. We do this all day. But if you ain't got good music, you don't get this far. That's where it starts at. So you see, Taj, respect him. This is officially the DTP office. We ain't signed no paperwork, nothing like that. But we checking up, checking him out, looking at him. I fuck with him. I co-signed a dude. He got good music, so you should respect him. We gonna end it like that. We holler at y'all in a minute.